everybody welcome to my channel today i'm gonna be doing a case review so this is my iphone it's an iphone 11 i mean i still love it i'm not someone who gets the newest phone every single time because i feel like phones are just so much more expensive nowadays like, i could do a whole lot with a thousand dollars so it always hurts to buy a new phone because it's like the price just keeps climbing up anyway i'm gonna be reviewing a case i got from velvet caviar almost a year ago but it is still available velvet caviar has a bunch of cute cases i did buy this with my own money by the way but i figured i would show you this is the zodiac one and it's really beautiful i'm a virgo and let me know what your sign is down below if you believe in astrology so we're going to talk about this case we're going to go through it we're going to unbox it and put it on and i'm going to show you my older case and technically i feel like velvet caviar cases do last a pretty good amount of time i usually try to catch them on sale they're usually between 28 to 30 dollars but i think they're very up to date with the type of phones that they cover with their cases in terms of like galaxies also but like the newest iphones are always available and stuff so we're just going to do a quick review and let's get started So that's cool. So this is from Velvet Caviar. It's a protective phone case. It is their Zodiac one. I thought I would unbox it on camera just because why not? I don't know. I have purchased from Velvet Caviar before and I'll show you the one that I have currently. I bought one from like Cardi Bible a while ago and then I have like a doggy one but because I work at a farm it kind of didn't last long. I mean I'm a very clumsy person. I drop my things often so I don't know if it's a true reflection on these cases but it is so pretty. So it is transparent. It says, thank you for choosing us. We've got you covered. If buttons are stiff, stretch me out, which I do find happens often. Okay, it's designed in New York City, one year warranty. So this is for the iPhone 11 and it's transparent. So I'm gonna go bring my phone because it's charging right now and put this on. Okay. So this is the case that I currently have from Velvet Caviar as well. Just removed it. It is heavily scratched up. But like I said, I have such a like high impact type of job where I'm like constantly jumping in and out of pens and cleaning like farm animals and stuff. So it's a little dirty on the inside, but it's mostly just scratches. I mean, it's still pretty cute. It's just not obviously as pretty as it looked on the first day that I got it. So we're going to put the Zodiac one on. I already have a screen protector that is also from Velvet Caviar, though um, I can't remember the price, but some places really upcharge you for, ooh, it looks so pretty. Some places will really upcharge for their screen protectors. If it's anything above like $20, I usually don't get it because I have splurged on $50 like protection screens. It's really cute, it's like right on the Apple icon. But yeah, I'm happy with it. The buttons don't seem too stiff, thankfully. Um, I have also tried like their marble cases, like I said, one from Carly Bible, which I did enjoy as well. These do hold up well, but I don't like their little like pop socket versions because I feel like the sticky part isn't strong enough, so it like falls off. But I'm really happy with this case. I think it's really cute. And yeah, that is pretty much it. If you're looking for like the ultimate protection but cuteness, I would recommend Caseify. But Caseify is a little bit more expensive. Those cases will run you, I think, at least $40 dollars for like the really high protective ones but it is something to keep in mind i just was looking for something on a budget and this was on sale I'm trying to think if there's anything else i want to say but i think we're good i will see you if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you very soon with another video bye